Sutter Health, one of the largest health care networks within the Bay Area, giving me an advanced copy of a report that was actually fast tracked, just giving how shocking the findings are that black patients diagnosed with COVID-19 are three times more likely to end up in the hospital for treatment than white patients. Bearing the front of the burden of this disease and its uh, negative impacts have been communities of color, in particular African Americans. The headline of an alarming new study conducted by Sutter Health, one of the largest health care providers across the state of California, finding concerning racial disparities in COVID-19 hospitalizations. We have three and a half million. Dr. Stephen Lockhart is Sutter Health's chief medical officer. African American patients were almost three times more likely than white patients to be hospitalized. There was also a greater tendency for them to um, be admitted to the ICU as well. The study pulled data from Sutter's two dozen hospitals and more than 100 clinics across the state, focusing on more than 1,000 of their patients testing positive for COVID-19 since the start of the pandemic and found more than half of all African-American COVID-19 patients had to be hospitalized for treatment versus just a fourth of white patients requiring a hospital stay, nearly three times as likely. Even more alarming, one in four black patients had to be moved to an intensive care unit for life-saving treatment compared to just one in 10 white patients, a glaring disparity. Dr. Lockhart believes in part access to testing is the issue. African-American patients are coming in later and sicker. So it's not about necessarily who is tested, but when. Lockhart says outreach is critically important in the black community, so patients don't wait until they're sick to get tested. He says we need to see more asymptomatic testing in black neighborhoods like this pop-up testing site that now comes to Antioch Baptist Church in San Jose on Wednesdays. He also warns that race and trust may be another issue as the state's focus shifts to increase contact tracing in the fight against COVID-19. There is really little chance that this will work well in, in our communities unless we do have um, these not only culturally competent but probably also race important. Uh, contact tracers. African Americans make up just 6% of the population here in the state of California, but they make up 10% of the COVID-19 deaths so far. Dr. Lockhart says that Sutter Health is working to bridge the disparities and do more outreach to black and brown communities to try and improve outcomes, and he hopes that other health care networks will follow suit. Reporting in the South Bay, I'm Julian Glover, ABC 7 News.